After the game being rescheduled a couple of times, game one was finally able to be played here on Saturday night. A tight ball game all the way through, but the Seminoles fell just short, losing this one 3-2 against the Texas Longhorns. What an outstanding ball game. I'm extremely proud of the fight we had uh, with our team. and. Um, I just can't say enough about from first pitch to last pitch and where we were at. We had uh, opportunities and they were in our hands and we know that as a squad and we're pretty excited about getting out here tomorrow and getting after two. I think we definitely saw a lot of the pitcher today and I think we'll see her again tomorrow. So our batters got a great look and I mean they know what to do up there. We got a good look at their hitters. So I mean we have a good game plan and we'll get even more information after watching video. So I think we're really prepared. Keep your heads high and um, you know they got some breaks and that's this time of year you got to get some breaks and get lucky. I think you know we get the little cue ball over to first base and um, you know, it's just one of the breaks you get to score a run, and you know, runs are really uh, um, precious right now, and so uh, we know that. But I just, you know, it's all about fight. Win, lose, or draw. I want the team to go out and fight as hard as we can tomorrow, and I'm just really proud of them today. Our whole season's been battling adversity, and this is just another extra step that we have to take to get to the World Series. And I mean, we've been there, we've been down by like six runs, so I mean, we can definitely do it. It just, we gotta take it one pitch at a time. Whenever I got my first hit, I was like, oh, she's hittable, and then <laughs> when, um, and then whenever everybody else started getting hits, so it was like, we, we kept getting confidence at our at-bats, and then we got our hits, but then they weren't key hits when we needed them, so hopefully tomorrow we can use our information that we got at our bats and then just get after them. The Seminoles have an upward battle tomorrow. They'll have to win two games tomorrow. It'll all begin at 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time right here in Texas. Stay with us throughout the weekend. We have your complete Seminole coverage in Austin, Texas. Jonathan Schlacey, Seminoles.com.